We're joined now by California native Julie Wentworth. Julie, talk to us about what it's like to be back here to Rolex, not only with a first timer that you've brought with you, but also bringing kind of your longtime partner here. It's really exciting. Um, as a rider, it's it's everybody's dream to get to Rolex, and here I am with two great horses. Uh, it's I couldn't be more excited. They're so different. Killian O'Connor, the gray, and Good Night kind of Good Night breeds fire a little bit. Connor is just a very gentle giant, if you will, very calm and collected always. Talk about how you adapt as a rider to going from one to the next. Well, it, it is quite difficult because they are exact opposites. Uh, Ari is quite feisty. Um, he likes to wring his tail. <laughs> he's gives everything a lot of room when he's jumping. Uh, he's very exuberant. Where Connor, he's just relaxed, takes it all in stride. Uh, it's not easy to go from one to the other, but luckily, like with Connor, I have such a strong and long partnership. I get on him, it's old hat. Where with Ari, I have to just get on and almost make him go a little bit like Connor. So it's not easy, but uh, I'm, I'm getting there. It's getting good. How much has it made you adapt as a rider and kind of even of a rider of your caliber at the top level, how much has it taught you? Oh, it's taught me quite a bit uh, to get from, to get on one horse to the next and be able to adapt very quickly is, is not easy, but that's how you get good at the same time by riding so many different horses and so many, and so many horses that are completely different. That's how the great riders like Philip and William Fox Pitt, uh, that's why they're good. And you haven't been here in a couple years, but had great success here last time you came with Connor. Talk about what it means just to have him back here. Oh, I couldn't be more excited. He's such a good partner to have, and he's given me so much experience at this level. And the first time we were here in 2009, he was a trooper. He helped me out in places where I was very green and very inexperienced and I was able to help him out from time to time but I think it was mostly the other way. But he's given me such an amazing education to have him back and to be in a place where I'm, we're a few years along now and I'm even more experienced is very exciting. We can maybe improve on our final, final score. And you have a terrific owner and trainer in Tracy Bowman. What does it mean to have somebody so supportive and how important is that to your success? Well, I think it's really important. I've been with Tracy since I was eight years old. It's been a very long time and the partnership has grown into our business. Um, she's there for me on not just a training level, but also a emotional level and we oftentimes finish each other's sentences. That's how much time we spend together. So, but it's, but it's what we've developed in our program and it couldn't mean more to me that she came out to Ocala for the last two weeks before we were here and we've been on the road and it's been very, very difficult for the both of us, but we've been able to do it together. Well, we are very excited to watch you here and welcome you back to Rolex and good luck. Thank you.